Focus Blast about to send this Melmetal crashing like Terra Luna Crypto. What is going on everyone? Ox here with another video. If you're new to the channel, we do upload Pokemon Go content mostly related to PvP. And if you're a returning subscriber like Citrix, thank you for the support. In today's video, we are shoutcasting some battles in the Open Master League level 50. However, we are featuring a team with only level 40 Pokemon. These battles were submitted to the channel by Stevie Robo, and they are featuring a team consisting of Mewtwo in the lead with Dragonite and Regigigas in the back. Regigigas is running Ice Hidden Power that is the preferred typing for Hidden Power on Regigigas in the Master League, and it has a double nuke moveset with Giga Imp impact and focus blast so we should be in for some interesting battles if you enjoy this type of content please consider leaving a like and a comment down below it really helps the channel grow and without any further ado let's jump into the first battle right now all right so these are some viewer submitted battles handpicked and submitted to the channel for shoutcast they are taking place between the ranks of 14 to 16 so not quite at the maximum rank of 20 for season 11 but there should still be some very entertaining battles right here mewtwo into gengar gengar definitely is not the most meta pick for the master league but we are going to swap out into the dragonite right here running dragon tail is going to reach this dragon claw that's going to force a shield out of the Gengar, and they are going to reach another move. Dragonite decides to no shield this right here. Another Shadow Punch is able to Dragon Tail all the way down, and we see the opponent bring in a Guard Chomp. One Dragon Claw is going to actually force the second shield, and now the opponent is going to be shields down with Regigigas coming in. And at this point, with a two shield advantage to Regigigas, we are about to see just how dangerous this Pokemon could actually be. Looking to commit to taking out this Garchomp using only hidden power ice, and that is going to get us ready to land the big nuke move. Mewtwo in the back. Here comes that Giga Impact. Hit him with that bang. There it is. Mewtwo getting absolutely one shot right there. That is 100% damage, worthy of an instant replay. And that is a preview of what you can expect to see in this video, jumping into battle number two. We got Mewtwo into a Gardevoir, going to stay in this matchup right here. Mewtwo is going to apply a lot of pressure with the Psy Strikes, so the Gardevoir is going to be forced to start using some shields if it is intending to stay in this matchup. Second Psy Strike coming through, and as we saw in the first battle, when shields are down, Regigigas is going to go to town. So Mewtwo is going to allow this move to go through right there. Regigigas comes in, likely going to commit to the hidden power down. We'll have to shield up the synchro noise right here but should be able to farm up a bunch of energy and that is what it does let's see what's going to come in and feel the wrath of regigigas it is a heracross very spicy team giga impact bang there it is heracross one shot just like that mewtwo tyranitar in the back it is not running smackdown so this is actually a pretty solid matchup here for the Dragonite against the Bite Tyranitar. Another Dragon Claw coming through. Tyranitar taken out. And another impressive win right there. This team is quite dangerous. If Regigigas could get the opponent's shields down. And it looks like that is the main objective for Mewtwo in most cases. Force these shields and then leave the rest for Regigigas. Let's hop into battle number three. We have Mewtwo into Dialga. Opponent is going to reach the move first. Mewtwo decides to no shield. One HP and a focus blast dream. Opponent needs to shield. Bang! There it is. No shielding. Absolutely insane. Not sure why they chose not to shield right there, but we are going to take those. Regigigas comes in against the Togekiss, and the opponent inexplicably swaps out to Melmetal to catch this Focus Blast. Bang! There it is. Catching that smoke like the Phoenix Suns got worked by Luka Doncic and the Mavs in Game 7. Absolute 
domination right here in this battle two nuke moves no shields being used i have no idea what happens right there but it makes for some entertaining content we got mewtwo into melmetal right here going for that side strike bait opponent calls and they swap out into a beautiful shiny palkia side strike coming through once again opponent this time is going to shield and another side strike coming through mewtwo putting in a lot of work right here and a cmp tie very unfortunate for the opponent swaps out into the reggie gigas now and the opponent's going to throw the aqua tail gets the shield out of the reggie gigas it looks like the reggie gigas may try committing to the complete hidden power farm but i don't think this is going to be possible so let's see what happens but the opponent instead swaps out into Mamoswine, setting up for this Giga Bang. There it is. Mamoswine taken out. What in the world is going on in these battles? Holy smokes. But wait, if this is a Draco Meteor, Dragonite going to get. It's an Aqua Tail. What is in the back? It's that Mel Metal. This game is over. Just needs to go for. Oh my god goodness superpower what in the heck is going on in rank 14 dragonite going for the dragon claw defense has been lowered melmetal still going to be able to hold on here even after trying to throw this game with the rock slide it looked like manchester united took over for that team and tried losing that game but the heya melmetal ended up holding on and saving them once again this season let's hop into the next battle so we have mewtwo into tyranitar not running bite so this is actually a winnable matchup for mewtwo but it still needs to land that focus blast to have any chance going for the side strike bait right here needs to get that shield which it does and we'll see if tyranitar believes or doesn't focus blast bang there it is the bangs just keep on coming in this video. And that right there is a Vaporeon in the Master League. Dragonite swaps in and here comes the Glaceon. Double Evolution team right here. Got to admire the spice. Glaceon is going to take it out. Regigigas comes back in. And believe it or not, Vaporeon, while it is a very spicy pick and something I would not recommend for the Master League, it actually could beat Regigigas. So in this particular situation, Vaporeon is actually pretty good, but unfortunately for the opponent, they have no shields left. And without shields, Vaporeon is a sitting duck, just waiting to get absolutely blasted by this Regigigas. Bang, there it is. Another one in the books. Let's hop into the next battle. So moving up now into rank 16, we have a Mewtwo lead into a melmetal once again we are running focus blast so let's see how this plays out right here looks like the opponent lagged before swapping out into their own mewtwo so building up to the shadow ball bait going to throw this side strike right here and that is going to force the shield out of the opponent and the opposing mewtwo is actually running confusion as the fast move so makes a big call on the side strike right there going to get off their own that's going to be no shielded and able to outpace to the next side strike this should be enough to knock out the opposing mewtwo and they end up taking a shield plus switch advantage melmetal comes back in definitely should be no shielding right here but they do end up shielding and throwing a move instead of thunder shocking down this is definitely a mistake right here dragonite comes in no real strong answers to Melmetal, but they do have a two shield advantage. Is going to no shield the Thunderbolt. Very likely that this Melmetal is running a Thunderbolt plus superpower move set, or even potentially single moved with only Thunderbolt. The Dragonite is going to go down here. This trainer preserving both shields for the Reggie Gigas is going to shield up at this point and this will likely force the opponent to swap out and reveal their final pokemon which happens to be tyranitar could go for the focus blast but we're seeing a little bit of the bm right here with the resisted giga impact 
not enough to take out the Tyranitar right there, but able to finish it off with the Hidden Power. Looking to get to another move right here is going to shield up. Super Power would be enough to KO. Not sure if Thunderbolts would, but didn't want to take the chance. Going for the Giga Impact for that 1 HP bang. That was more like a Nano Impact as opposed to a Giga Impact. See what I did there? Alright, I'll stop. Mewtwo into Togekiss here for the next battle. Going for the Psy Strike. These Charmers are a little bit problematic. You would prefer to see them in the lead because Mewtwo at least is forcing some shields here out of the opponent. Togekiss decides to no shield the second one. Mewtwo is going to allow itself to go down right here and come in with the Regigigas. Or actually come in with the Dragonite instead and the opponent brings in their own Dragonite. So having the energy lead right here is very nice. Going to force the final shield with the Dragon Claw. I imagine you allow the Dragonite to go down now. Come in with the Regigigas. Finish this thing off with the Hidden Power. And when shields are down, you already know how this goes. Melmetal going for the move. Super Power actually won't KO, so they decide to no shield. Focus Blast about to send this Melmetal crashing. Terra Luna Crypto. Bang, there it is. Regigigas putting on an absolute show tonight. Let's keep it rolling, hopping into the next one. Mewtwo into Dragonite, not the best lead to see right here but is going to decide to stay in, able to reach this side strike. Dragonite should be able to survive one, but it does deal a lot of damage, and the Dragonite does decide to shield. Second side strike coming through, and the second shield coming up from the Dragonite. Mewtwo going to no shield, and they get hit by the Draco Meteor. Holy smokes. That must be a single move Dragonite right there. Regigigas into the Metagross. And you already know what's about to come. Focus Blast. Is this enough to one shot? Why did I even ask? Of course it's going to take out the Metagross. Dragonite comes back in. Gets hidden powered all the way to the ground. Garchomp in the back. Here comes the Dragonite. This game is absolutely finished. Just like Manchester United season, but not Liverpool's chances of winning the Premier League after the Manchester City draw. It's coming down to the final week of the season. What do you guys got in the comments down below? Let me know. I personally don't think Manchester City's going to bottle it, but it won't be the first time they've done it this season. Mewtwo into Togekiss. Once again, we've seen this matchup already in this video. Mewtwo will stay in this matchup. The main objective here is to try and force these shields, setting up for the Regigigas nukes in the back with shields down. So let's see what the opponent's going to do right here. They actually do end up double shielding. Mewtwo is going to allow this to go through, at which point Regigigas will come in here, look to farm up a bunch of energy, Perhaps even shield one of these moves from the Togekiss. I mean, at this point, you definitely have to shield. The charms are doing a lot of damage. Flamethrower comes through. Kyogre in the back. Here comes the Giga Impact. Not enough to take out the Kyogre, but Dragonite able to Dragon Tail down. And let's see what the opponent has in the back. We'll see that Togekiss come back in. That gives Dragonite a bunch of farm. And that is perfect scenario for this Dragonite, able to throw back to back Dragon Claws right here. This is going to put the Garchomp extremely low, and Garchomp, the poor guy, can't even mud shot down. Dragonite able to take that game. Let's hop into the final battle of this video. Mewtwo into Dialga. Is Dialga going to get revenge for that Focus Blast earlier in this video? We are about to find out. Mewtwo once again building up to that Focus Blast and is going to get this move off first. Dialga this time is going to respect it and shield up. Mewtwo is going to shield in return and let's see if Mewtwo tries reaching another Focus Blast right here. Is able to get to it. Is Dialga going to double shield? Yes they are. 
commit to the Dragon Breath down. And Reggie Gigas is going to come in. Swaps out into the Dragonite. Looking to catch a Iron Head, I suppose. Gets hit with the Thunder instead. Is going to reach this Dragon Claw right here. This should be enough to take out Dialga. And we will see what the opponent decides to come in with right here. It happens to be a Groudon. And things are not looking too good right here for the Reggie Gigas. Is going to let the Fire Punch go through. Big call right there. At this point, I suppose they are going to shield and they call the Earthquake. Game winning play right there. Committing to the farm down. Needs to survive this Fire Punch from the Groudon. What is in the back? Will it get one shot? Well, it happens to be something we know will get one shot from previous experience. You two in the back. Bang! There it is. 100% damage. Taking out the Mewtwo. That's how it's going to end. If you enjoyed these battles, please consider leaving a like and a comment down below. And if you'd like to see more content like this, consider subscribing. Thanks for watching.